Could that so, be Jennifer Aniston? What's your take on Jennifer Aniston? Well... Given you're, you're, you're hitting gold mines at the moment, I want I to know, know what your take on Friends and Jennifer Aniston is. Well, she's... I don't know. She's a strange... It's strange. Because all the other people in Friends, they haven't, though, really, have they? They no. haven't achieved anything. No, Except for really. Joey, who's become Joey all over the place. Well, yeah, they haven't really achieved no, that much. No, they haven't. Ross has... No. I've always had a soft spot for Jennifer Aniston. I think she's I quite have. sassy. I have. I think she got a lot of sympathy with the Brad Pitt and Angelina. Thing, yeah, and yeah, and also, isn't she one of these Hollywood women that nobody's got a bad word to say about? I think so. She, a bit like um, the lovely lady that I filmed, Tasha Richardson. You know, she's sort of. Oh. Her, I think she has that sort of cachet around her that she's just a goodie. She's not yeah, a goodie. Yeah, and she's this big. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, I, it's a shame that she hasn't had anything because I, I imagine with the right script and the right project, yeah. she'd be she'd fire. Anyway, well, who knows? This could be it. This, this be is it. a new series. Yeah, she keeps it's, on trying. She keeps on trying, and you got you got to love a try. Yeah. Uh, what's your take on Reese Witherspoon? Ah, oh, now I am a sort of Reese Witherspoon fan in the sense that I think she's a cracking actress. She's often in cracking things. But you know, sort of like some people just love her across the board. Yeah, but Nadia, I don't. Yeah, Nadia, Nadia wants does. to be her best friend. I, I don't. Oh. Uh, I, I mean, she can be intensely irritating. Right. And sometimes I can think she can be too Reese and not enough the character. Oh, that's interesting. But, um, yeah, I know what you mean. I yeah. think I could agree with that. Yeah. yeah. But, um, I think the character that she was playing in Big Little Lies is probably quite close to what she is. I'm so sure that it felt is. quite authentic. But you're right, she does sort of trot out the same her. She does, she does, yeah. Okay, um, and Steve Carell. What do you think of Steve oh, Carell? I love Steve. But as we had at the time, a lot of discussions about can he do comedy or can't he do comedy? Oh, no, what am I saying? He can absolutely he do can comedy. He can absolutely do comedy. It's but whether can he can do serious yeah, yeah, or not, yeah. it's a beautiful boy. Okay, well, yeah. Apple, you know, I'm, <laughs> without wishing to sound like I'm promoting Apple streaming, but, but this morning I am. Um, this is a new series called The Morning Show. And, series? Yes, oh, series, series called That's The Morning Show, in which Jennifer Aniston's uh, the head of a sort of uh, morning show. Mm -hmm. It's quite relatable for Nadia. It'd be good if she was yeah, there to, to yeah, watch this. Yeah. Uh, and she, uh, anyway, something something sort of happens with her husband and Reese Witherspoon, I think, is a bit of a sort of comp competitive thing. Uh, okay. So I'm wondering whether this could be a bit of that. Do you remember that Nicole Kidman To Die For film where she played that the was, table weather woman? That was the best thing she ever did, I it think. It was absolutely superb. It was the best thing Gus Van Sant did. I think he directed it as well. Did he? Yeah, yeah, First yeah. thing she did, first film. Yeah, she was yeah. cracking. If you haven't seen it, see yeah. To Die For. Yeah, yeah. But, uh, Anyway, so this is, you know, I like films like Broadcast News. I don't um, know, What was the other? Anchorman, all that stuff that's set yeah. in that sort of weird world of television. Yeah, TV, American TV. Would, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and of course, films like the uh, one with Jake Gyllenhaal, Night Hunter, you know, where, you know, the people who live on the fringe. Oh, I really like that film. Anyway, so this is, I, I don't know if this is a comedy or not, but there's a lot of excitement around this. It's called The Morning Show. This is going to be a new era for The Morning Show. Eight seconds to you. Cue her. Good morning. I'm bringing you some sad and upsetting news. And while I don't know the details of the allegations... She's throwing me under the bus. Mitch Kessler, my co-host and partner of 15 years, was fired today. You! We are facing the biggest crisis in our history. <laughs> oh, my God. My life just ended for no good reason. We're in the middle of an epic rebirth. Her cell might have expired years ago. I want you to start grooming some new people. I don't fit the mold. What mold is that? Any mold, really? <laughs> <laughs> Your show sucks. Thank you. It's Thank barely you. news. I want wardrobe tests, screen tests, makeup tests. We need a contract. Where's legal? Ready? Legal. I'm ready. Most people want to trust that the person that is telling them about the world is an honest person. Ooh. 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 Like you. Oh. Yes. Good news. Your words spoke to America. People are noticing they want more. Watching a beloved woman's breakdown is timeless American entertainment. I just need to be able to control the narrative so that I am not written out of it. You stole my life. You left me in the woods with a pack of wolves. You just think I'm gonna do this? This chair could be yours. I don't want your job. Oh, hi. Ooh. You walk 
walk out that door, you are never going to get back in. The part you guys never seem to realize is that you don't have the power anymore. And frankly, I've let you bozos handle this long enough. Oh, good girl. We are doing this my way. We had a disagreement. <laughs> wow. Promising. Yeah. It's Promising. nice to see Jennifer Aniston not looking so little girlish. Yeah, I tell you where I got disappointed in the trailer. I was thinking, great, this is going to be a series about a woman fighting for survival of a mm. certain age mm. and doubting her own achievements, doubting what she is, who she is, the business. I mean, we've all been there with the industry of television. It's a, it's a thankless and, and shark-infested uh, world, guys. It, is. it really is. It is. Um, and, and then at the end there, it felt like the bloody star system kicked in again, where Jennifer Aniston doesn't want to look weak. And suddenly he's like, we're going to take control of this. And at that point, I was like, oh, it's going yeah. to be a vanity project. Well, yeah. You know, whereas like, I think Jennifer Aniston could really climb on top with her career if she was like, just becomes this destroyed woman. Yeah, oh, I almost even wondered if Reese Witherspoon was, who seems to be one of the most powerful women in Hollywood at the yeah, moment, yeah, yeah. whether she was sort of doing a thing of almost saying to Jennifer Aniston, look, you never had the parts you should have had. Are we gonna, Maybe. We're going to raise you up in the in And that's the right. Which I, is fine. I, I think that's but fine, you've got yeah. to, the writing has got to cover yeah, that yeah, yeah, and everything yeah. else. And also the other danger, and, and without wishing to be like a succession bore, when you've had something as rich as succession about the world of media... Okay, about the boardroom. Uh, okay, yeah, about the boardroom, exactly. You know, we can, what succession proves is that you can cope with quite complex concepts yeah. in the boardroom. Yeah. And so suddenly it felt a bit cartoony, putting yeah. a glass down, saying, you're not going to have it, guys. You know, you need a bit more believability. You do, do you yeah. know what I mean? Okay, Actually, it's Actually, that's very true. And that's, yeah. that was the last thing it ended in. Yeah. As if to take us into it. Now, yeah. that's, that... Nothing does that enough. better. Yeah, no, no exactly, no, exactly. No, exactly. So promising. I've definitely got to watch it. I think Nads will like that. You know, television is an incredibly duplicitous environment yeah where everyone is you know and there are many careers like this it's not the only one but the, mm. you know but everyone is is you know you know backstabbing everyone else mm. uh so that's why i like it as a, it's always a rich subject because you're watching the kind of the rise and fall of of, of talent and, and not so, yeah yeah it could be good